What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I wanted to share with you a massive fit jeans haul, that's right. There's a good chance that if you have an Instagram and you follow a lot of fitness type of influencers, that you've seen fit jeans, probably being worn by them. I know for me personally, I've been wearing them for over a year now. I can attest that the rumors you heard are pretty accurate. They are dope. These jeans are meant to be comfortable and hug you in all the right places, if you know what I'm saying. But do not get it twisted, girl. They have a lot more than jeans. They're actually dipping and diving into athleisure, which has my heart. I love athleisure. So you're gonna see bits and pieces of that in today's haul, along with obviously some jeans. I have a lot of experience with their jeans, so I wanna talk about sizing and things like that. For those who have been having questions, I see you guys in my DMs, don't think I don't. So definitely hit that subscribe button if you love activewear and athleisure as much as me. You will be seeing that weekly up on this here channel. So subscribe, follow your girl on Instagram and TikTok for all things fitness, because together we got this. Now let's get into this haul, let's go. All right guys, so a huge thank you to Fit Jeans for hooking me up with everything you see in today's video. Real quick, before we get into the meat and potatoes of this haul, I wanna share with you what I'm actually wearing today. It's Fit Jeans. So these are their loose branded joggers in the color Sage, and I have it paired with their ribbed crop top in the color Sage as well. Everything you see today is in a size extra small. If you've been following me for a while, you know my true size in all brands is usually a small. I size down in fit jeans, but we will get into sizing in just a little bit and go into detail about that. I am a huge lover of athleisure wear and especially joggers. I love a nice, cute fitting jogger. This sage color is a pale green. I love sage. I feel like it could be a spring or fall color. You have the fit jeans branded logo going all the way down in almost a sporty type of stripe. Even in a size extra small, it still has a bagginess to it. And I do love that they have it kind of paired with the ribbed top because you have a little loose down here and then just more of a form-fitted, cute, almost baby doll type of crop top. Obsessed with these buttons. They are real buttons in case you were wondering. They do snap. They're actually like snap buttons, not the kind that are annoying that you have to like make it through the whole buttons. You know what I'm saying? No one's got time for that. I have not even looked at the rest of the haul, so this is all first impression. I haven't even opened a single package yet. I wanted to save that for us time. Okay, can you throw me that big ass bag? Thanks. Okay, guys. Let's see what we got. Ooh, we got quite a bit to look at in here. Grab bag style, like the claw machine. What did I get? Yes! Okay, I was hoping that this would be first, not gonna lie. So these are their traditional denim ripped high-waisted shorts. We got a pair of shorts in here. I never tried their shorts before in the color Azure Blue. Oh, oh, okay. I wasn't expecting this because I feel like they look small as hell, but we're about to find out. Will you stretch to my glutes, please? Tell I feel a little stretch in there. You best stretch. I normally never wear jean shorts. I really don't like jean shorts because they always ride up in my crotch, so we're gonna put these pretty much to the test and see if they do that. I hope not. You can see the way their jeans are designed. They have more of a cinched in waist and flare out just a bit as they should. Okay, let's briefly talk sizing. I know, I'm a true size small, but I size down extra small in fit jeans because I've tried their jeans in my normal size small and what tends to happen is it'll fit just right until you get to the hips area. That ends up gaping on me. So I size down to an extra small and then everything seems to fit accordingly. But that is just me, that's how it fits on me and according to my measurements, I know that Fit Jeans has said before that when it comes to sizing, you should always go with your hip size over anything. So before you go with what you think should fit your glutes and your legs, those parts are normally stretchy. It's the band that gets a little bit tricky. So extra small is my Fit Jeans size because of that. Okay, well, two things came out. <laughs> Let's talk about this yellow hello. <laughs> okay, so we have the women's crop top t-shirt in yellow. I wanted to get a basic tee to throw over, see how they look with the jeans. 
This is just your basic solid crop top, nice and loose, a little bit of a boxy look. It's feeling stretchy, thank goodness. This is very much a plain t-shirt. There is virtually nothing going on in terms of logo except for a little baby fit jeans black logo up by the neck area. Overall great to just style as a casual vibe. Okay, we got a pair of jeans. Oh God. Okay, what are we, we got? <laughs> smells like pool water. It smells like a pool. Okay, so we got the women's 360 high waisted in Arctic light blue. These are actually one of their most popular jeans. Okay, one of their populars. This one I did not get distressed because I swear to you, everything I own fit jeans is always distressed. So I wanted a plain blue that I could possibly dress up if I ever wanna go out to dinner. So the Arctic light blue is more of a medium blue, I would say. High waisted, of course. Keep in mind, they do have more mid rises even flare options. But I always opt out for the high-waisted. That is just what looks best on my body. So I'm feeling a good amount of stretch. That's a good stretch. That's a good sign. I think I'll be able to get into these. Okay, so the front pockets are not real, but the back are, thank goodness. I personally like my pockets in the front to be real because that's where I put my chapstick, right? I don't want to sit on my chapstick, but it's okay, I forgive you. I'm gonna try to look past that. Even the shorts did not have real front pockets, but the back are good. I don't, just add in their other pockets, would you? What do we got? Yes, queen. All right, so I wanted to grab a, ooh. Oh, damn. Oh, that's like, that's some quality shiz. I can feel it right now. This is actually the Hannah's crop sweater in black. And in case you guys don't know, our girl Hannah Oberg has a line with fit jeans. I'm sure you've seen it all over her page. So this is her version, her cropped black sweater, extreme stretch. I can feel the high quality behind this sweater. It's not a flimsy piece. Just from the looks of it, it has that slouchy drop sleeve look. Do you guys see that Hannah Oberg? There it is. Yes, nice written embroidered text on the back. Oh, okay. So we got a different kind of color heel. Mmm. Oh yeah. So these are the women's traditional mom V2 super ripped high-waisted jeans in azure blue. So I'm a little bit confused because apparently these are both azure blue. The shorts are labeled azure blue and so are these mom jeans and they look completely different. Who's lying? So I can already feel that these have a little less of a stretch in them. I do think mom jeans are kind of designed to be real and raw jean feeling where it's not the ultimate stretchy vibe that all of us tend to go for. I think this is just a looser, straightforward jean material. These do have real front pockets, that's a plus. These are definitely dark. I didn't expect them to be that dark, but I love the distressed look. What do we, okay, so had to get another one of these because the truth is I am in fact obsessed with these ribbed tops. I think it is a cute, trendy look that you can dress up or down however you prefer. I got the same one in mauve. I wanna grab the matching jogger with this as well in case I wanna wear it with the matching jogger, but the mauve is so pretty. Look at that plummy color. And don't think for a second I am not gonna touch base on how heavy these price tags are. If I'm being totally honest, yeah, they are definitely pricey. Fit Jeans is not a cheap company. <laughs> Almost every aspect of this haul has a heavy price tag, including these little rib tops. At the same time, I will give them the fact that the quality is definitely 100% there. There's nothing cheaply made about these. I kind of feel like it could justify the price if you're willing to spend a little bit more on quality. I still have jeans from a year and a half ago that still maintain its shape, that still look like they're brand spanking new. So keep that in mind. They're definitely not your, your cheap, like wear them a few times and then they look like crap and then you gotta throw them out. So just keep that in mind. Okay, last but not least, yay. 
So I wanted to mix it up a little bit with the whole jeans. I got a light pair, I got a dark pair. Now I want to try out a gray pair. I didn't want a solid black. When it comes to full, I wanna add in more of the gray tones here. There's no distress on here either. Again, I do plan to wear these more in the winter and fall months. So I don't know about you, but where I live in New Jersey, it's ice cold all the time. So I can't have air holes in these or else I'm gonna be freezing my tush off. No thank you. These are their 360 high-waisted. I cannot wait to break these out with a pair of knee-high boots. Okay, maybe pumpkin patch picking. There's a good stretch. We might be in the clear with this one. We're about to find out. So let's go ahead and try these pieces on, shall we? Come on. All right guys, so I broke this haul up by outfit. I kept the sage green crop on, but the mom jeans, hello. So it's definitely not baggy like I thought it would be. I really anticipated it to be outward, not like that at all. They're just hovering over me. They have a really nice stretch. I didn't quite feel that when I pulled it out of the bag, but it's definitely there. I'm stretching, getting down to the flow a little bit. So these jeans would be perfect for those who do not like skin tight jeans. I have a feeling these are gonna look really good rolled up. Yes, how cute. It's like late summer beach bum vibes. My only issue that I have right now with these jeans is I can feel it riding a little bit up where I don't like it to ride up. In other words, uh, my good. <laughs> Even this extra small, cause it's a baggier style, kind of gapes in the back. So I think a little belt action would do these jeans well for me. Ooh, okay. So we're cooking a little bit with some fire flames. These are the 360 high-waisted. I have a few things to say about these jeans. Number one, when getting them on, they were tough to get on. I know that I have to break them in a little bit. I get it. They do make the glutes look pretty fire in my opinion. These jeans also snatch the waist a bit too. I gotta make mention of that. And I really love that because it gives a nice hip to waist ratio. These are great to just kind of complement those curves a little bit, make it look a little hourglassy. So it definitely has my vote. I do love the style of these jeans. There's no gaping at all on these, which again is why I went with the extra small. I paired it with the mauve ribbed crop. What do we think? This is such a rich, beautiful, almost chocolatey color. I love it. But yeah, a really nice flattering pair of jeans. Once you work them up and you put in the work, it does pay off. They're really, really flattering on the parts that matter, I would say. <sighs> Finally, some comfortable shorts in my life. These jean shorts surprised me a bit. I didn't expect them to be this comfortable. They are very, very stretchy and they're not digging in the waist. They're not digging around my thighs. They are extremely comfortable. How is the gape in the back? Is there any bay? Yeah, no, not an issue. These are not your traditional stiff jean shorts. These are stretchy and body glovey fit. That's my preferred fit, girl, because I wanna kinda of feel like I'm wearing gym shorts in a way. I don't wanna wear jeans. <laughs> Overall, I love the let up here. There's no cutting off my circulation. The distressed look is really, really, really cute. This is my very first time trying their jean shorts, so a very good impression. I would definitely order more. Uh, yeah, I don't really think I have a bad thing to say. They're really freaking comfortable jean shorts. <laughs> And I really like how it looks with this loose crop top. I give, I think it just gives a really carefree summer look. What do you think? I love the cut of this crop. I just have to speak on how it comes up a little higher in the front and lower in the back. I think this would look great with even gym leggings. I would totally wear this as a cover up to the gym, work out a bit in it because you do have that stretchy gym type of fit feeling. So uh, yeah, keep that in mind if you need some cover ups. Okay, getting ready for the season, I see. So these 360 gray were 10 times easier to get on than the 360, same exact pair, but in the light blue. So I don't really know how to wrap my head around that. It must be a dye thing. I can't help but notice, I think fit jeans, the way they design the back of their jeans, they take the pockets and lift them in such a way to kind of help give an illusion that your bum is taking over the back of the pants. So I see what they're doing. There's no band gaping on this one at all. Yeah, the stretch is unreal. Look at this. I'm literally jump squatting in these with no problem. You don't hear anything ripping. <laughs> 
And I really think it looks cute with this cropped black sweater. Go, Hannah. You go, girl. I do like the bagginess of the sleeves of this sweater. I also like, again, the high to low look, giving a really effortless look to my outfit. This is not something I would wear full-fledged to a gym because I'm already heating up in it. So I kind of got to take it off right now before I faint. But keep that in mind if you're looking for a cozy hoodie for the full. Ooh, but other than that, these jeans are fire. Alrighty guys, so that concludes today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this Fit Jeans haul. If you have any questions, just comment down below. I'll try to help you out. So if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe. Weekly videos just like this. We test out activewear, all different types of brands. We're just having fun with it. Subscribing helps me out more than you know. It helps me to create content just like this for you guys. Thank you all so much for watching and I will definitely catch you in my next video.